Hello, guys. I'm your host, uh, Ali Khan. Today, we are going to learn controlling in SAP S4 HANA. It's uh, pre uh, pretty much very simple and direct. So, we start. Uh, first of all, uh, we have to maintain a controlling area. The two ways, short keys is OKKP, or the other way is go to SPRO. Controlling, then general controlling and after that maintain controlling area go here select this search for your controlling area this is your controlling area so your name of the controlling area, company code. If you are using only one company under one controlling area, you can use this. Otherwise, if you are have different companies under one controlling area, then cross company, currency term 20, currency according to your company, chart of account, and this is the main thing. Call center hierarchy, when you are making a call center, so you will see this. That will be W. Hierarchy. So whatever name you mentioned here, you will see in the uh, call center hierarchy at the time of making a call center. Then these are the things which you want to have, make it active. Call center, order management, equipment management, active, uh, activity based management, we are not making active. And by default it is account based, so it is like this and project sale accounting warehouse commitment this you need to be ticked various company code validation these are the symbol and fiscal year from 2022 infinity and here is the company you want to add so your company code will be added from here you just select new entries and you add it after that then number range uh, T code is gank or if you want to go from here probably I think it's so it is gank gank is there Select your company code controlling area. In our case, it is at this controlling area. So first, first, uh, first of all, you have to copy it. So this is you can copy it from any standard company. So this in from. You will select any standard company like uh, I have selected this one A triple zero and two is your company company code whatever your company so like in my case the company is ZWSC I will do it like this and copy it so I as I already did I am not going to do it again so I'm just showing you these are the number ranges one to four i have copied it just make sure that coin is assigned to zero it will automatically assigned so just uh, open it and check it out that coin is there and these will automatically assigned After number range, we have version number zero plan and actual means that plan and actual both are there in controlling. So just make sure that these are ticked plan and actual. Plan actual is there because in next step we have to assign this version to our company code analyzer so just make sure plan actually is selected and 
define Liger. Now we will use this version. So for you, you have to make a new entry. But as I already read, I will only show you. See, this is the same version which we at the last step we did. So we are assigning our controlling area to this version and with this our ledger. That's it. So now we go to property center county. First of all, set a controlling area. If you are working in different controlling area, so you can just uh, set to your controlling area. So in controlling, and this is a proper center counting. Yes, this is controlling. Then we move to uh, property center accounting. In that basic setting, we have controlling. So when you are uh, working on a different controlling area, this is the way to go uh, to go to your controlling area. Then maintain controlling area setting. So at first, you have to maintain like in my call center, you have and define the hierarchy in property center you have to mention the hierarchy this dummy center first we make it then it will come automatically here so first we just define this property center hierarchy and currency is same 20 and company is this active uh, in 2021 this is active and i will show you somewhere else where you can activate it so this is all so after that you have to define hierarchy whatever you define here like this one this hierarchy it will come here you can see that see this is a hierarchy so it's mean it's kind of umbrella underneath uh, you can make a different uh, profit center and this dummy center we have to first define it then it will come here automatically dummy center we uh, uh, it will we can use it when there is uh, we the system cannot find any profit center so uh, at that time sap assigned dummy profit center so we we will not actually use this thing this is for the system if the system unable to find any profit center so it will use this as by default so for hierarchy after hierarchy we just uh, check it out hierarchy after that we create a dummy center as i already made so i am not going to create it i will just show you this is my yes so this is a profit center this is the name for the dummy person name hierarchy property center hierarchy you have to select this property center hierarchy and dummy property center is uh, selected and the company code as we have um, using two com uh, company codes so uh, both are coming here so use make this make it activate it it will be active so after that if you go there go back and see it will be here as well as in here so it will come then automatically here so after that you have to just define the proper centers This proper center for proper center, you just have to, and you can use these T code, whatever the proper center you want to make it, you can use these. And this is the other one, this I can show you. You just have to check it out, okay, E7.
ok y se so nothing to do just have a look so we are here yeah i will show you from where activate profit center Now we are going to activate your financial accounting, then generalizer accounting, then master data, profit center accounting, activate browser, find your company name. This is my controlling area. So I have activated for 2021. So you have to do it and just tick it. So it will activate. So these things, how these work, profit center, I will make another video in which you will, uh, I will explain it in detail how profit groups we create uh, under profit group, we create a profit center. So details will be in this uh, other video. Now number range for the local it is for the local I mean uh, means internal transfers in the controlling we define the number range usually we are not using it but uh, just for your information GB02 I will show you GB this is my company code so I have defined for 2021 this and this. So this is for just for internally transferring and controlling. controlling. Then next step is controlling parameter for the actual. So in profit center accounting, go to basic setting, then activate direct posting and set controlling parameter for the. So just take these two in 2021. Then call center accounting, like my profit center accounting, we maintain here the hierarchy. Same we will do for the call center as I told you whatever we have mentioned here the hierarchy will come here. So if we go to OKKP just to revise it. OKKP. So this is the cost and hierarchy, same like profit and hierarchy. This is the cost and hierarchy we have made. Only difference is that in profit and accounting we have uh, mentioned the dummy, but in cost center there is nothing, uh, no concept of uh, dummy. So whatever the uh, hierarchy come, we have defined here, the name it will come in this. So it is same like umbrella. You can uh, make cost center under this. Okay, Eon. So this is the main hierarchy for cost center. Underneath there are different cost center according to your company name. Again, I will, I mean, show you how to make a cost center, cost center group. In different video and these are the codes for cost group and this this uh, we deal this thing in some different and these two are the just for splitting I think I already mentioned in my splitting video if not I will show you in other video this is the clearing account we are using for default center if you want to make uh, define the range you can use this one so this is all for the controlling. There are so much in controlling. Uh, I will try to 
uh, mention all the things what are coming in controlling how we use this thing in uh, separate videos until then uh, goodbye and if you like the video please like and subscribe goodbye